it is very possible to make a fudgy brownie and a butter cake all in one. Keep watching. Greetings to you all, beautiful family. How was it going? I hope everyone is doing amazing. It's your girl, Claudie, and I will be showing you how to make a fudgy brownie butter cake. It is so easy to make, and once you make this, you will definitely want to be making it all the time. If you're new here, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification. Trust me, you're in for the best. To start with our ingredients, I will start my mixing bowl some chocolate chip and butter. I will just get to microwave it and I just microwave that for about 2 to 3 minutes. Then I will just make sure I mix it. If you don't have a microwave, you can melt this over a pot of boiled water and I will advise you not to put it direct onto the fire. I just added in some sugar please guys always check the description box because i always drop the recipe there right now i'll be adding in two large eggs at room temperature sometimes some people will come and comment like where is the recipe why don't you write the recipe on the screen it, like i always drop all my detailed recipe in the description box if you don't know where the description box is just look at the corner of this video you'll see a drop down arrow just click on it and you see the description box right now i'm adding in some all-purpose flour I will just mix all that together. I'm using half cup of all purpose flour, right? But like I said before, the description box is going to carry the detailed recipe. So for our fudgy brownie, just mix everything when it is perfectly combined. You will now go ahead and transfer into a baking pan. My baking pan has been greased. Let this go to the preheated oven 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 15 minutes. And to make our butter cake, I'll be using some melted butter. The next to come in is some milk. I'm using whole milk here. You can use any milk, all right? To lash eggs at room temperature. Just mix until perfectly combined. So for your brownie, please make sure you don't over bake it. Like it's going to be really hard and dry. Okay, so just maintain the time 15 minutes, 350. I just added in some sugar. Mix the next to come in is some old purpose flour. Just one cup of that. We have some salt, nutmeg, last but not the least, some baking powder. That's one teaspoon of that. So mix until perfectly combined. So after mixing, this is the texture you are supposed to achieve or this is the texture you have to see after baking. You see that so smooth. You see that? So smooth. So after 15 minutes, our brownie, you see that? It's looking so, so good. I will just put my butter cake on it so everything bakes together guys when you get to try this recipe it is so good and easy very presentable anyway you guys know cloudy i always bring in the best recipes and many of my recipes are no fail right so after transferring that it's gonna go to my oven the same 350 degrees fahrenheit for about 25 minutes to 30 minutes until you're fully baked so guys, our cake has been fully baked. The flavor is amazing. My home is filled with that amazing flavor. Right now, I will just take it out from the baking pan. Then I'll go ahead and slice it. Guys, it has already been cooled, okay? But I'll just let it cool again before I go ahead and slice it. So just watch out not to like hold hot cakes you're gonna hurt yourself or burn yourself so after it has been cold i'll just cut it right there and show you guys how it looks on the inside guys just imagine like a butter cake and a fudgy brownie all in one isn't that amazing so so good so guys if you haven't subscribed to this channel what are you waiting for go ahead and hit the subscribe button 
let this channel grow let us reach 100k support your girl you know i put in a lot of efforts to bring you guys amazing recipes every day all right so support your girl subscribe like share tell your friends about claudy follow me on facebook instagram tiktok twitter i post recipes on those platforms every day yes guys every day that's to show you guys how i love what i do how i love to share my recipes how i inspire others so guys thank you so much for watching if you watch this video to this point let me know how you feel about this recipe thank you so much to meet again in my next video bye for now and stay safe